Oh, hello there, sir. And welcome to my monster brothel, where we cater to customers who are looking for a more than ordinary experience with a woman. I don't think I've seen you here before, and I remember the face of every man I see. This is your first time coming here, isn't it? <laughs> no need to be embarrassed. Everyone has their first time in a brothel at some point. No shame in that. <laughs> Why, yes, I am a sex bitch. What gave it away? My horns? My swishing tail? My wings? I'm just teasing you, sir. There's no need to be embarrassed about any desires or thoughts in my brothel. Here. As I said, we cater to every kind of taste and desire you could imagine. No matter how deprived they may be considered outside these doors, nothing is off limits inside. So, what kind of experience were you looking for here? What kind of girl were you interested in? And how much experience ha- Oh. <laughs> hey. Sir. I hope it isn't too proddy for me to ask, but are you perhaps a virgin? Well, <laughs> succubus are just kind of able to tell and smell the level of sexual experience on a man. And she happened to have a very fresh scent on you. <laughs> Am I right in assuming so? <sighs> Come um, now, there's no need to be shy in admitting it. I see. So you are. Well, we have plenty of girls here who would be perfect for a first-timer like yourself. So, if you'll just follow me, I'll go get my book that has all the different girls who are available right now. All you have to do is point at the one you like. I'll send you to your room, and she should be there shortly after. So, if you just follow me down the hall... <sighs> you know, you don't need to pretend not to look at me, right? Do you think I wear this revealing lingerie because I don't want people to look at me? I wear it because I get wet when people stare at my breasts and my ass. So, you acting like you're trying not to look at me is actually getting me wet. <laughs> oh, you dirty. Are you sure you're really a virgin? Getting a succubus wet just by looking at her. Mm. <laughs> Here we are. So, as you can see from this book, we have categorized all the different types of girls we have into different sections based on their experience and expertise, along with pictures of each kind. So, this what kind of girl are you looking for? A werewolf? A harpy? A slime girl? We have just about every kind of girl you can think of here. I even have a ghost girl who can possess you and combine her orgasms with your own. Oh, a succubus. <laughs> we absolutely have a list of different succubi to choose from. And I can point out a few who would absolutely love to get their hands on a cute, delicious virgin such as yourself. So, which of these would you like to choose? Do you prefer the older, big breasted mouse? Or perhaps you prefer the smaller and younger girls? あ、
Oh. Uh, I was only teasing, but... Was I perhaps right? <gasps> Well, you would actually prefer me? <gasps> I'm sorry, sir. Though, I am a succubus. I... I do run this place. Make succubus in my and I usually make it a policy not to sleep with customers myself. Oh, oh, please don't look so disappointed. Just make me look so disappointed. Why don't you head upstairs to your room? Room 24. Just wait there and I'll see what I can do. It might be a bit of an extra way, so stress the vacation and enjoy some of the refreshments that are laid out there, okay? Also, you should find a very nice robe hanging on the back of the door. If you wouldn't mind, you could slip out of your street clothes and into that in the meantime. I think you'll find it'll be much comfortable for you. <sighs> Off you go, darling. Hello? It's me. Sorry for the way. <laughs> nice and comfortable on the bed already. And I see that robe fits you comfortably as well. I had to freshen up a bit and change into a robe myself. This is really something I never normally do, just so you know. But we do pride ourselves on having outstanding satisfaction with our customers, and... <laughs> well, I don't know. I suppose I just found you particularly cute. And relaxing. So, just for the night, I'll indulge both you and myself. And I'll do it. I'll be the one taking your virginity. <laughs> so, just how much experience have you had with a girl? Outside sex, of course. I see. That isn't really much. Well, why don't I just dim the lights a bit and light a few candles? I can tell you're nervous, and I want this first experience to be as nice and enjoyable for you as possible. I sense you are quite attractive to me, but also sense something else. Do I make you nervous? Is it because I'm a succubus? Or because I have so much experience when it comes to matters such as this. I see. Well, though I have slept with more men and women than I can count, as all succubi have, one thing you should understand is that, as a succubus, I view every time I have sex as almost like a first time for me. And if it's performance or impressing me that has you worried, then you needn't worry about it. I plan to view this experience with you as just experiencing it with you alone, not with those I've had before you. <laughs> Besides, I'll be moving you to it every step of the way. Now then, I'll just... Oh, 
how to use their mouth as well as succubus can either. Men have said our mouths feel just as good as our pussies, and that our suction is unreal. And whenever my tail starts swishing around like this, it usually means I'm very, very excited. I'm sure you can tell. Can you feel it? The heat of my pussy going through your ropes. The wetness. My succubi are far hotter inside compared to any human girls as well. I can already feel you hardening against me. <laughs> so that's good. Nothing turns me on more than a man getting excited by my charms. <laughs> well... No need to lay there with your arms at your side. Touch me. Feel me. Starting with my hips. Hmm. I can tell you like them. Enjoying how wide they feel. And how soft and smooth my skin feels. <sighs> I'm sure this is the first time you're really getting to touch a woman this much. Are you surprised at how soft we are compared to you? My breasts? Of course you may touch them. Grab them and knead them as much as you like. No need to worry about being gentle. I can assure you that we succubi are very hard to break. <laughs> them in your hands just like that. It's for me. Oh, they're quite soft and squishy, aren't they? I can't believe it, but they're already starting to make my nipples go so hard. Yes, you are. Feel them for yourself. Mm, try rolling them between the ends of your fingers. <gasps> yes, just like that. Goodness, I must be honest with you. I haven't ever gotten my nipples this hard so quickly before. I can't remember the last time I was given goosebumps. Oh, oh, I so want to show you what else there is to experience. But first, I'll just lean over, like this, and take your adorable face in my hands. Now, just try to follow the rhythm my mouth moves at. Know any better? I'd, I'd say you've had a lot of practice. 
pushing your tongue into my mouth certainly took my breath away. Now, I'm just going to open the front of your robes a bit. Like, a handsome looking chest. And now I'm going to start kissing my way down. Do you like the way my lips feel on your chest? I certainly love the way your chest feels against my lips. <laughs> you seem to be pitching quite a tent now. So, I'm just going to open your robes and give it some air. Oh. This is quite an impressive clock. To think you've been hiding this thing inside your robes all this time. Well, since you're still so new to all this, I think, um, I think I'm just going to start off giving you a blowjob for now, if that's okay with you. The night is still very young and it has been the entire time. <laughs> Good. And don't worry about me. For a succubus, drinking down cum gives me almost as much pleasure as having an orgasm or sex. But I can't have you coming too soon. So as a precaution, I'm going to take my tail and wrap it around the base of your cock. Just like this. <laughs> that should help make sure your clock behaves. I can tell how badly you want it. If I just swing down and blow on it. And breathe down on it. Feeling my hot breath run all the way down your cock, turning into a tickling breeze on your belly. It just makes you ache to be taken into my mouth, doesn't it? <laughs> you are so adorable. All right, I won't make you wait any longer. So I'll just. Start with some soft kissing, right on the head. adorable virgin, but your pre cum is some of the sweetest I've ever tasted. Oh, yeah. so tasty. I'm very serious, darling. Because I cannot wait any longer myself. I'm 
Until I've completely taken your virginity for my own. I've given you your first blowjob, but it's not enough. It's not nearly enough. Don't you even worry about the cost. Because I don't plan to charge you for any of this. Oh, no, this, this isn't about business. This is just about pleasure, and me getting what I want, giving you what you need, and it's going to take most of tonight at least. <laughs> so, my darling, prepare yourself for round two. Had a moment to catch a breath. How was that for a first blowjob? No other mouth out there would have felt as good as that. And I must say, I don't think any other girl could have swallowed all that oh so sweet cum you were putting out earlier. Had I missed even a single drop, it would bring shame to me as a succubus. And of course, if I were anyone but a succubus, then our night would have ended at that blowjob. And you would have gone home feeling no doubt satisfied, but still wishing the night could have lasted longer. How fortunate, however, that I am a succubus. <laughs> because, as I said, I can make it go away. That satisfied feeling of being drained flaccidness and sensitivity on the head of your cock, I can turn it all around and make it feel like you haven't come in weeks. Like you're one of those poor misguarded souls who take part in that no fap November event. Ugh. 
Mind you, most succubi hate the month of November, specifically for that reason. But they also love it, because it's the easiest time of year to get our sustenance. You have no idea how easy it is to get a man to give in to our kind. And a month where they purposefully deprive themselves makes it oh so much easier. <laughs> but I'm rambling now. So I digress. How about it? Want me to do it? Do you want me to get your cock all hard and back up again? So you can gift me your virginity? And then cream into my tight little pussy for the rest of the night? <laughs> That's my boy. So, the way I do it is quite simple. It's an aphrodisiac that's in my saliva. All I have to do is kiss you, and give your cock a little attention as well. And that's all it takes. So, are you ready? <laughs> Good, because I am. Now, open your mouth and stick out your tongue. <laughs> Yes, just like that. Now I'm just going to straddle you and slowly start leaning down like this. <laughs> like seeing my tits hanging down? Mm, good. I love the way you look at me. And next I'll just... So <laughs> Already starting to feel it, aren't you? That feeling of desire returning the sense of your head, making your cheeks feel hot. But slowly working its way to the inside. Eventually, it will get to your cock. <laughs> In fact, it looks like it's starting to get a little rise out of you already. But, we're going to speed things up a little bit. Starting to feel a little more flush now, aren't you? Oh, kisses leaving behind little wet spots, aren't you? Oh, gorgeous Oh, 
Kun sinä sanoi se, että itse It's been a long time since I've been that enthusiastic about the deep throat in the cock. I must say, the effect you have on me has me rather perplexed. No matter. I can tell your cock is on the verge of exploding. So hot and so swollen. Let's oh, show you how to do and finally unwrap my tail from the face of your poor cock. I want to see you back into the again. I want you to come to me. I know what her house in your life. and me getting what I want, giving you what you need, and it's going to take most of tonight at least. 
<laughs> so, my darling, prepare yourself for round two. <laughs> Had a moment to catch your breath. How was that for a first blowjob? No other mouth out there would have felt as good as that. And I must say, I don't think any other girl could have swallowed all that oh-so-sweet cum you were putting out earlier. Had I missed even a single drop, it would bring shame to me as a succubus. And, of course, if I were anyone but a succubus, then our night would have ended at that blowjob. And you would have gone home feeling no doubt satisfied, but still wishing the night could have lasted longer. How fortunate, however, that I am a succubus. <laughs> because, as I said, I can make it go away. That satisfied feeling of being drained, the flaccidness and sensitivity on the head of your cock, I can turn it all around and make it feel like you haven't come in weeks. Like you're one of those poor misguarded souls who take part in that no fap November event. Ugh. Mind you, most succubi hate the month of November. Specifically for that reason. But they also love it. Because it's the easiest time of year to get our sustenance. You have no idea how easy it is to get a man to give in to our kind. And a month where they purposefully deprive themselves makes it oh so much easier. <laughs> but I'm rambling now. So I digress. How about it? Want me to do it? Do you want me to get your cock all hard and back up again? So you can gift me your virginity? And then cream into my tight little pussy for the rest of the night? <laughs> That's my boy. So, the way I do it is quite simple. It's an aphrodisiac that's in my saliva. All I have to do is kiss you and give your cock a little attention as well. And that's all it takes. So, are you ready? <laughs> Good, because I am. Now, open your mouth and stick out your tongue. <laughs> yes, just like that. Now I'm just going to straddle you and slowly start leaning down like this. <laughs> like seeing my tits hanging down? Hmm, good. I love the way you look at me. And next, I'll just... Already starting to feel it, aren't you? That feeling of desire returning that starts at your head, making your cheeks feel hot before slowly working its way down your body. Eventually, it will get to your cock. <laughs> In fact, it looks like it's starting to get a little rise out of you already. But we're going to speed things up a little bit. <laughs> oh, I'm just um, trying to move my way down your chest. Um, down this beautiful chest. Um, such a cute looking belly button. Huh? What if I just... <laughs> I 
is such a cute little reaction. And you're starting to feel a little more flesh now, aren't you? My line of kisses leaving behind little wet spots to get you even more horny. <laughs> and next... Oh, this gorgeous and wonderful cock of yours. That gives out cum that's just so sweet and to die for. I'll just... It's been a long time since I've been that enthusiastic about the deep throw in the cock. I must say, the effect you have on me has me rather perplexed. Well, no matter. I can tell your cock is on the verge of exploding. So hot and so swollen. So, I'll show you mercy and finally unwrap my tail from the base of your poor cock. And maybe soon I'll take you back into my mouth again. I'm never having a life. I'm going to shoot that con into my mouth when I'm very angry. I'm going to If I had let one of my other girls do it and later found out just how sweet you tasted and how cute you were, well, I never would have forgiven myself. <laughs> I'll just lay myself down here next to you while you ride the high down. <sighs> Once you're ready, I have a little trick you need to suck it by that will help shorten up the satisfactory period of your life. I could have even gotten a taste of you if I find myself having only an ethical I honestly have 
never wanted a man more than I have you. And I don't think... The effect you have on me has me rather perplexed. Well, no matter. I can tell your cock is on the verge of exploding. So hot and so swollen. So, uh, I'll show you my heat by letting wrap my tail from the base of your poor cock. それじゃあ、待ってくれ。私。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。
and me getting what I want. Giving you what you need. And it's going to take most of tonight at least. <laughs> so, my darling, prepare yourself for round two. <laughs> Had a moment to catch your breath. How was that for a first blowjob? No other mouth out there would have felt as good as that. And I must say, I don't think any other girl could have swallowed all that oh-so-sweet cum you were putting out earlier. Had I missed even a single drop, it would bring shame to me as a succubus. And, of course, if I were anyone but a succubus, then our night would have ended at that blowjob. And you would have gone home feeling no doubt satisfied, but still wishing the night could have lasted longer. How fortunate, however, that I am a succubus. <laughs> because, as I said, I can make it go away. That satisfied feeling of being drained, the flaccidness and sensitivity on the head of your cock, I can turn it all around and make it feel like you haven't come in weeks. Like you're one of those poor misguarded souls who take part in that no fap November event. Ugh. Mind you, most succubi hate the month of November. Specifically for that reason. But they also love it. Because it's the easiest time of year to get our sustenance. You have no idea how easy it is to get a man to give in to our kind. And a month where they purposefully deprive themselves makes it oh so much easier. <laughs> but I'm rambling now. So I digress. How about it? Want me to do it? Do you want me to get your cock all hard and back up again? So you can gift me your virginity? And then cream into my tight little pussy for the rest of the night? <laughs> That's my boy. So, the way I do it is quite simple. It's an aphrodisiac that's in my saliva. All I have to do is kiss you and give your cock a little attention as well. And that's all it takes. So, are you ready? <laughs> Good, because I am. Now, open your mouth and stick out your tongue. <laughs> yes, just like that. Now I'm just going to straddle you and slowly start leaning down like this. <laughs> like seeing my tits hanging down? Hmm, good. I love the way you look at me. And next, I'll just... starting to feel it, aren't you? That feeling of desire returning that starts at your head, making your cheeks feel hot, creeping slowly, working its way down your body. Eventually, it will get to your cock. <laughs> In fact, it looks like it's starting to get a little rise out of you already. But, you're going to speed things up a little bit. この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、この、
such a cute looking belly button. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a cute little reaction. And you're starting to feel a little more flesh now, aren't you? I like kisses <laughs> And next, oh, this gorgeous and wonderful cock of yours. Heck, give that come that's just so sweet and to die for. I'll just.